this is an electric car. I think it's number six. I'm not sure. Anyway, um, this is right here is my omnidirectional generator concept, and I have no clue if I could pull this off. Uh, a former friend, Bob Manns, I think he last time I heard he was living in Blue Springs, Missouri. He did some amazing things with uh, compressed air and golf balls, getting them to spin extremely fast and then like launching them to the air. And it was almost magical what he did with it. And uh, anyway, I've been reading about uh, how you know you can generate heat by compressed air and a spear with dimples or holes in it. And I thought, and I'd always had an idea of an omnidirectional generator using like um, Tesla coils arranged like in, in a spike to a, to a core, which would be probably uh, some kind of capacitor. And then the electricity would uh, come back out through the dimples in this metal sphere that'd be rotating and in you know increasingly different kind of directions and things um, I originally thought of them as like engines and sphere tires but there were so many problems with that I abandoned that concept and thought of more of a starter uh, for an electric car using compressed air as its hybrid uh, to get get the car going was this different types of uh, ways to generate electricity and not having the big heavy battery. So, and then compressed air, you can go to a gas station most places and buy, you know, fill it back up with compressed air. You might need a, somewhere where you could get, uh, you know, higher pressure, but that would be relatively simple to set up. Uh, where hydrogen and a lot of other alternative fuels would be really difficult to set up a chain of, uh, of uh, fuel stations across the country. Compressed air would be like a cheaper way to go. So uh, that's my concept. Uh, don't know if it would work. Uh, don't know if it would generate the electricity need to start up the process. Um, you know, all this is iffy. And, uh, but uh, it's something I've been thinking about since 1975. Thought I'd start playing with it online and on YouTube and see uh, what the rest of the world thought about it. Thanks.